Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Happy Monday. Hope you all had a great Palm Sunday yesterday. This is the week for our for all believers everywhere, especially Friday. Friday is, is a good Friday because Friday is the day that we as believers got our sin debt paid in full at the cross by Jesus Christ. What a powerful way to open up this video. Because Friday, if you're a believer, is a good Friday because that was the day your sin debt and my sin debt was canceled forever. It was automatic. It was officially auto and automatically stamped, paid in full. Hallelujah. Woo! You guys are going to get me preaching. But today's message conversation is this. You can do it. You, you, we all have those feelings in life where we just go, oh, I just can't make it. I just can't seem to make it. Well, you know what? You can make it. I think I made a video about this sometime last year. And it was, I think I titled the video, Stop Saying I Can't and Start Saying I Can. So you can do it. Stop stop listening to the naysayers out there. Stop listening stop listening to those negative to those negative Nellies out there who say, ah, he can't do anything. He she can't do anything. I mean, look at her. Who would want to marry that person? Or or, you know, who would want to marry him? I mean, look at all the baggage they got. My gosh, I'm not gonna amount to anything. Flush that. What does scripture say? Philippians 4.13 says that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. There we go. That enough right there is validation. Paul Paul said that to the church in Philippi, in Philippians. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And that's so true, folks. Did you know that it is impossible? To do anything without God in your life? It is. You can't even take your next breath without God. You're like, sure, again. All right, go ahead. Try. You can do it. Stop listening to these negative ads you hear on TV or these negative comments from your friends and all that stuff. They don't care about you. They only care about themselves. If you have friends like that, and I think I've talked about this in a few in a previous video or two, stop hanging out with those friends. You don't need those type of friends in your life. It's like people who are handicapped, but they're not, they may be handicapped physically, but they are handy capable. I know people who are handicapped physically, but they can still make use of the handicap in a positive way. They can be handy capable. I, I think I gave the example of a few in a video, a few videos ago, like last year or something, but Johnny Erickson Tata, look at her. She was a swimmer. She was a, she got a diving accident, qu a quadriplegic from the neck down, paralyzed. Did she just give up? No. She may be handicapped, but she's handy capable. Why? Because because she's going around the world, spreading positive hope to the world. So let me just tell you this: no matter what you're going through today, you can do it. You can do it. Get those friends around you. Get those positive friends around you. Get your get those positive family members around you that encourage you and coworkers that say, you can do this. You got it. Go for the gold. Don't quit. Don't give up. Okay, guys? So guess what? You can do it. I believe in you. Guys, have a great day. God bless. 
Have a great day. Remember, you're loved by God and life is short. Make it count. Have a great day, everybody. God bless you all.